Hey everybody, I have some big news and some big changes and I was hoping to get some feedback from everybody. But uh, the biggest and craziest one is we now have a two-year-old foster child and we kind of knew it was coming. We didn't think, we, we were hoping everything would work out for our friends to keep them and be able to move out of state, uh, but that didn't work out. So we had about a two-day notice. And yeah, I had forgotten how hard it was. I was like, oh, two-year-olds are easy. They're like, it's like having a raccoon turn loose in your house. I had forgotten just how crazy, uh, like fun. I mean, it's fun. I, I will say that. It is fun. Uh, but it's just chaotic. I had forgotten just how messy they were. Like we had gotten to where everyone was doing chores and it was easy and to take care of the house. And now it's like, I give up. It's just going to be a mess. It's just how it's going to be. So that is big. The next big thing is I hit a thousand subscribers and I'm about to get monetized. And I'm super, 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 super excited that any of you would even care to watch that you comment and are kind. We have a lot of kind comments and I'm trying to decide if I should put more energy into this. I really enjoy it. If it could be a potential income stream to help the family, I, th I think I'm thinking about really uh, making a habit of posting regularly. Uh, I want to do videos that people like that are still doable for me. So if there's things that you like, I know that the food bank videos do really, really well, which I find really funny. Um, but my mom's like, oh, I love watching grocery hauls and I love seeing what people are eating and what they do with the food. I guess that's a thing. I didn't know. So if that's what you want to do, if like you want me to film like other people's grocery hauls or just like where I shop and what I do more or should I do more cooking, like take the stuff that I get at the food bank and then turn it into a meal. Is that something you guys would want to watch? Um, it just, it needs to be a part of what's normally already part of my life. Like when I go mushrooming, I try to take you guys with me. When uh, we go shopping, I try to take you guys with me. So if there's a way I can bring you along in my life, or if you guys just don't care and you want to see anything, everything, if you want to see my messy laundry pile, I can show you that. <laughs> if you want to come help me fold laundry, we can do that. Uh, I hate matching socks. I just loathe matching socks. I don't even do it. I just tell the kids they're on the couch, you figure it out <laughs> and get your own socks. But yeah, that's number two. Oh, and part of getting monetized, they have like memberships. So down below, you'll see like a membership thing. And there's different levels and different things you can offer, but I don't even know what you guys would want. Do you want to see more, like, more behind the scenes? you want to see more of, like, the other stuff that I do that's not food-related? Uh, like, ministry stuff? Which I'd be limited there. I don't know what you guys want. Let me know. Some of the maybe nonprofit stuff that I do. I might be working on more murals. That could be interesting. I don't know. You let me know what you want. Um, would you want like reels that aren't public, like your own private stuff, group chats, like brainstorming, maybe live? I know a lot of people go live. I don't know. You guys tell me what you're interested in and I'll see what I can do. Um, cause this has been super fun. I'm not going to lie. I love doing this. I hate seeing my face, like looking at the camera. I don't really enjoy that. I've looked at my face my whole life and it's I'm tired of it <laughs> and hearing my own voice isn't something I crave so I will work on that but yeah and the other thing is I will be going to Israel soon and I know that probably sounds ridiculous going into a war zone but um, we've been watching the news pretty closely we have friends over there and I know it doesn't sound right but technically statistically we are safer over there as tourists than we are driving on our own freeway here like the route I take to get into big town to get groceries um we've had a lot of deaths on that freeway in the last year and I don't know how many tourists have been lost since October 7th of last year but I I tried to find them and I don't think that there's any so they do a really good job of taking care of tourism because that is one of their main industries over there and um, quite often if there's going to be a demonstration or someone's going to do something, they usually warn the tourist agencies not to go in certain areas because there could be something going on. And so they do a pretty good job. So I don't feel like I'm in danger. 
You know, it's probably not the safest place. But I've been to Mexico and I, I feel like I'll be safer <laughs> in Israel than in certain parts of Mexico I've been in. So that is to come. I'll try to film like groceries there and food there and compare prices and just what, what we eat and stuff. It should be pretty interesting, I would think. And uh, if there's anything scary going on, I might try to film that too. But I'll probably try to put any warnings. Like if something crazy happens, um, I will probably film it. Um, I mean, within reason. I'm not going to be like um, running for my life. I won't film that. <laughs> or if someone needs my help, I'm not going to be filming that. But um, like if there's stuff flying overhead... I'll try my best to capture that. I find that so crazy and so sad over there. Um, so it'll be good to go and help the economy of both the Palestinians and the Israelites over there. Um, there's a lot of different groups of people living there. I don't think people realize how diverse it is. So it'll be fun to capture that for you guys. Um, if you have any questions about that or anything you'd like me to film over there, um, that'll be coming up. I'm not going to say when, but that will be coming up. And... Um, yeah, if there's anything you guys want to see, please let me know. Uh, anything you don't want to see, let me know. Um, I won't be showing you the kids very much. Uh, I can't show the new one at all. So don't expect that. Yeah, but yeah, if there's a direction you want me to go, let me know and I will consider it. I'll talk to you guys later.